because I've always, I've always questioned God. How do I use my work to glorify the kingdom, to build the kingdom? I want people to be able to see God in my work. Yes. So, so you, 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 you're very, it, 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 it sets you on edge because you're careful about what you do. You're careful how you do it. Uh, and you want to be sensitive. Um, in order to do that, I, I, I would think that a, a person would have to be sensitive to the voice of God because you don't know how God is going to speak to you. You don't know how he's going to lead. So you, you, you're walking on this. It's not a tight rope. It's not a tight rope because there's no discomfort. There's no anxiety about that. You're at peace, but you live this kind of life. You're listening. You're sensitive. You're conscious because he's going to do what you ask. Uh, and just, um, this is April. <laughs> my birthday was in March. The 27th was my birthday. Okay, happy belated birthday. You just had a birthday. I just had a birthday. <laughs> but that, that image came to me in March, that image. And uh, I just secured some space in um, Shelton, Connecticut. Wonderful. Because I, I work from my studio here at home, but I need space. <laughs> I need space to do the, this, this work. So I uh, just signed the, the lease to the space today, and uh, I'm excited to uh, create that piece. 